A human that stands for nothing will fall for nothing. It is better to be a person of fire than a person of success. It is better to have your standpoints in a moral way than that you give about nothing and that you fall for the next charlatan. It is better to be true to yourself and encourage the radical of others. Better to be false to an other. To accuse your own neck horns. I stand for something. I stand for anti-oppression, anti-slavery, anti-discrimination. That's the reason that I've been vegan. I've been against discrimination. In which kind of way then? I? And the people that do or support this discrimination. I've been judgmental. But that isn't, that's not something bad. I've been judgmental because I have the capacity to judge I mean judge mental so if somebody said that you've been judgmental and you can explain why you act the way you act and it being logical and not insane judge rapists. You have also the right to judge murderers, pedophiles and other disgusting disposal. I have the right to judge meat eaters because their pay for the rape, torture and abuse of other animals. And there is no moral justification for doing this insane actions against our animals. Human beings can easily survive on plants only. Maybe this works be harsh and controversial to you, but that don't mean that it don't be true. Our human physiology is so that we being for 100% herbivore. From the side to side room of our lower jaw, our teeth, to the fact that we sweat to our pores, to pores out down, to the fact that we don't skin so, can see so well in the dark, we have no night vision, to the fact that we don't can change and end one squirrel with our hands, to the fact that we have analyzed in our slime to digest stars. I mean a lot of other facts by why being vegan. Why we saw being vegan. But if you think that you now have a mind to eat and you want to change and eat it with your bare hands. Try to go after one screw. Or find a dead body. And eat it with your hands, without knives, without the help of, of a knuffing knife. Just like bears and lions do. But you don't like it actually the way it's been made. You don't like it. You don't absolutely like it. You only do it because the society tells it to, and you spice it with herbs, with sweet sauces, with salt, with pepper, and with a lot of herbs, with fires, 
sure that they don't taste anymore the way it naturally tastes. You know, like anything works being with it. So, why not make a plea on the lines for the way you are living? make amends and move forward there was no counter argument against veganism so and stand for something you stand that you stand for nothing these animals be treated horribly disgusting This is your chance to stand up for what we write and oppose injustice. Instead that you support the status quo and let it be just like it be. This is your chance to say I win against the justice and show it. You don't can make me you don't can show me that you uh, don't that you've been for a uh, Compassion when you only uh, say it. Kindness begins on the dinner table by what you eat on a daily basis. You don't get pray for peace and then do hypercritical finance things. That's what all the people do uh, with barbecues, they're grilling, they're paying some smack to uh, kill some animal or other living sensors being for them. Picking or pick or on shape, okay. or oh, um, turkey. Now, good people oppose discrimination and hatred. Good people oppose injustice. A threat to justice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. Good people. Don't pay for the rape, torture, and abuse of other living beings. Or commit this. Good people don't do this. Good people. Good, nice people. Don't, don't do this. With all the people that claim that they've been good, that they've been nice, the brave for all the time. They're committing any day atrocious acts to other living beings. How will you feel if the place been put on and you've been the victim and they eat you, mock you exists, so that your life don't matter at all. That's how it been to me in cow, chicken, or turkey on this planet. Live just by the golden rule. For the most religious people, it's well, believe in it, but they don't act it. And most atheists also think it's a pretty wise way to live, but also don't act it. Though. Do something that you don't want there to you. Since nobody in the world wants to be treated the way we treated the animals, it's pretty logical to become vegan. They've been raped, tortured, and abused only for a sandwich. Step in the 41 century. This have to stop. As long as there have been slaughterhouses, there will be battlefields. And there will be not unlimited amount of researchers for researchers for the world. Humans have to learn to live with the rules of dependence on other species and the rules of species diversity. So, the only way that we can do that is become a vegan.
this is the most easiest way. When darkness and light become one, the reality splints are away. The truth becomes visible. Subscribe to my Instagram, YouTube, and my other channels for checking more info and more information from me. And I see you next time.